December 2016, my wife has booked a hotel for four days and it's in a region I've never been yet in Switzerland and that village is called Sevis, which is um, in Graubünden, which is the eastern part of Switzerland and we are currently living in Katzels, which is the westernish part of Switzerland we are close and uh, it's around two and a half hours to drive there and since I've never been over there I'll bring in my camera bag with me and hoping that I may have some opportunities to open it but like my wife said it will be a nice relax moment with the family for Christmas so let's see what I can do the next morning was gorgeous we could see the whole village where we are staying but not the village Fana, which is um, down covered in mist below and uh, Grush is on the right hand side and uh, wife not on the picture but I'm so excited to be in Grush in two days time I'm currently scouting for location, possibly for tonight or maybe for tomorrow morning. And it just seems that I've found a composition for tonight. I like this image. It feels that there is a reason why this lonely chalet is located there at the foot of this mountain range. Looking at the image itself, I'm trying to use this chalet to give a sense of scale of this mountain range. The texture of the rocks and shadows formed by the clouds demonstrate a rugged landscape. Did I say the other side of this mountain is Austria? As you can see here, the hard rays of light and I'm trying to use it in the next image. I'm very happy with this image, especially it panned out as I was expecting having the hard rays of light forming a diagonal together with the other diagonal formed by the silhouette of the trees plus the mist is creating a nice contrast to the image this whole experience I think is best translated into a black and white image since we are here the village fauna is under mist we could barely see it It's my last opportunity to take a snapshot of this village, service. Tomorrow we are heading to Grush. And last night I managed to take a time lapse. I'm hoping that you're going to enjoy it. is the third image and uh, the story about this image is that I feel sorry about the people living in Fana because the few days that we are here we have yet seen the village still covered in mist and well a few kilometers away where we are we are enjoying a nice sunrise but uh, not for the people living down there and um, it's uh, how it is, hence the reason of having a black and white image to express the mood. The other thing that I like about this image is the leading line created by the electric poles and uh, having T10 out in black and white brings out a nice contrast to this image.
been a while I'm looking at this mountain and part of me want to shoot and capture it but um, I don't know how to get close to it If you like this video, please do subscribe below and give a thumbs up. Until next time, take care. Bye bye. Thank you for watching.